I want to cover off something that affects a lot of people and it's very common in the Elemental Facebook groups. It's where you edit your website or you make changes and then when you view it on the live, you're not seeing those changes. Or well, maybe you can't see them, but someone halfway across the world can or the other way around. There are a few things you may want to do and you'll see these and hear these words a lot like regenerate the CSS, purge your site, purge your server, WP optimize maybe even rebooting your internet. And I'm gonna go through each of them one by one, and just show you what we're talking about. Really quickly though, the simplest one, whenever you get an issue where you've done an edit and you can't see it on your live screen, or maybe everything on your screen has turned into like a white screen with lots of blue text, and you're going, where's my entire layout? What you wanna do is go to Elemental, WordPress Elemental, go down to Tools, and then in the General tab, Regenerate Your CSS. When we say Regenerate CSS or Regen, this is what we're talking about. I tend to do both of them now and again, just because like they are so quick and easy to do. I'm not here to tell you which caching system to use, but use whichever one you want to go for. WP Rocket, Perf Matters, Auto Optimize, WP Fastest Cache, Lightspeed. There's loads and loads and loads out there, okay? But when you hear someone say, right, purge your site and purge your server, purging your site is basically go and find wherever you've got your caching plugin or whatever solution you're using and just clear your cache or delete cache, go for whatever you want, just clear it. It takes seconds, right? That's what we mean. Now, after regenerating and doing all of that, that still might not fix your problem. And this is where you gotta go to your server. You're gonna have different servers or hosting providers. So if you're not sure how to do this, check with your hosting provider, okay? I'm using SiteGround. I would go over to my site tools, speed, caching. And over here, we have dynamic cache. And I'm just gonna click this option here and it's like done hit the memcache and it's done. So that is where how I would purge my site using this option here, and then I would purge my server. I'm still getting issues. It might be that I've just got to clear out my WordPress databases and tables. So I'm gonna go in and install WP Optimize. It is free to use and you don't have to keep it on your system. You can install it, activate it, run one part of it and then remove it. But then again, because it is a caching system as well, there's no harm in keeping it. It is free to use. So if we go down here to uh, WP Optimize and I go to the uh, basically the Optimize tab here, I was gonna hit Settings, but it's Optimize. So just ensure that everything in the very first tab for optimization is picked and then hit Run. This can take five to 10 minutes. Just let it run. Don't touch your website, leave it. Just let it run and do its stuff. And that might also kind of force through and ensure that any latest changes are now on your system. Like I said, if you don't want to use, keep this on your system, just install it and remove it and your job done. But what if after all of that, you're still getting issues and you still can't see the live site? Here's a big tip. Check on your mobile phone. And if you're still seeing the same issues, either get someone else you know who doesn't live in your house or your flat or apartment or wherever you are to check your website as well, or go out for a walk and check. And if you suddenly notice that actually it's now looking okay, or someone you know, down the road or in another country is seeing it okay, but you're not, it might mean that your internet, your router has latched onto an old IP address. You might be sitting there thinking, you're talking rubbish. No, this is true. All you've got to do is turn off your internet for about five minutes and hopefully when you switch it back on, it should latch onto a different IP address and then lo and behold, you will see the changes you made. There are various other reasons as well in terms of why you're not seeing your live um, changes. Uh, some of it can be theme related as well, but most of the time, whenever anyone has this issue, regenerate your CSS, purge your site, purge your server, WP Optimize uh, if you need to do a cleanup of your database and just double check your router. In fact, I say to people, regenerate, purge, and just go for a quick walk. Just literally walk out your house, walk 10 meters away, and you'll be now latching onto the outdoor Wi-Fi, right? Not your home one or whatever. And if the changes are there, it kind of tells you what the problem is. I hope this helps you. I'm Imran Web Squadron. I hope you like, subscribe, share, and follow. I'll see you soon. Never break, always fight, never quit. Do it right, play the game, win it life. Have no shame, there's no time. Feel the pain, let the grind. I could change in my mind. Pick a lane, commit and climb. The only way to win it life. I never miss that fact. Taking big swings, bitch, hand me the bat. Put me in the ring, you'll go out in a bag.